Hello students, welcome back. I am Aditya Vardhan from adichemistry.com. In this presentation, you are going to learn how to derive ground state atomic term symbol, a very important topic for CSRNet, GATE, IIT JAM and other university level exams. Okay, let us recall. What is a term symbol? The abbreviated description of electronic state of a multi-electron atom using angular momentum quantum numbers which is represented by 2s plus 1 L J. Also keep in mind that a ground state term symbol represents the electronic configuration with lowest possible energy. Now look at the description once again, 2s plus 1 Lj, where s is maximum possible ms value, L is maximum possible ml value, and j is either L minus s or L plus s or s depending on the electronic configuration of ground state. Here ms is sum of the spin quantum numbers of electrons whereas ml is the sum of orbital angular momentum quantum numbers. Now let us see how to derive the ground state term symbol. The first step is to write the ground state electronic configuration for a given atom or ion. While writing the electronic configuration, we have to neglect any closed shells. For example, take carbon atom you know that 1s2, 2s2, 2p2 is the electronic configuration for the ground state carbon atom. Since 1s and 2s sublevels are fulfilled, we have to neglect them and write only 2p2 configuration. Now we have to arrange the electrons of these partially filled sublevels in the available orbitals so as to get maximum ms and ml values. A maximum ms value is obtained when the electrons are arranged according to the Hund's rule and a maximum ml value is obtained when the electrons are placed in orbitals with positive ml values as far as possible and also take care not to violate Pauli's exclusion principle while writing the electronic configuration. For example, for 2p2 configuration, the two electrons have to be arranged as shown below. These are arranged in the 2p sublevel by following Hund's rule without violating Pauli's exclusion principle. You can clearly see that two electrons have the parallel spins so that they will get maximum ms value. They are also arranged in the orbitals with ml values equal to plus 1 and 0 to get maximum ml value. Thus, S equals to 1, whereas L is also equal to 1. Finally, we have to assign the J value. J may be equal to L minus S if the orbitals are less than half filled, or L plus S if the orbitals are more than half filled or just equals to s if the orbitals are exactly filled. For example, in case of 2p2 configuration, since the orbitals are less than half filled, j is equal to l minus s, that is 1 minus 1 equals to 0. Now let us write the S, L and J values so far obtained for carbon atom. S is equal to 1, L is equal to 1 which is represented by the term P and J is equal to 0. So we can write the term symbol as follows 2S plus 1 L J. Here uh, S is equal to 1. So, 2s plus 1 is equal to 3. As L is equal to 1, we have to write the term P and J is equal to 0. 
so this is 3 p 0 or you can also say triplet p 0 so this is the ground state term symbol for carbon atom now one more example the ground state term symbol for nickel 2 plus ion for which the electronic configuration is argon 3d8 since the electronic configuration of argon represents all the closed shells we consider only 3d8 and you know that there are five d orbitals in a given d sub level with ml values equal to plus 2 plus 1 0 minus 1 and minus 2 the first five electrons are arranged with all the parallel spins according to the Hund's rule which states that no two electrons can pair up unless all the degenerate orbitals are filled with one electron each the last three electrons get paired up with the electrons in the orbitals with the maximum orbital angular momentum quantum numbers also note that Pauli's exclusion principle is not violated while writing this ground state electronic configuration for nickel 2 plus ion let us see s l and j values for this configuration since there are five electrons with plus half spin and three electrons with minus half spin the s value is equal to one for l value we have to sum up the ml values of all the electrons that equals to three and you know l is equal to three is represented by the symbol f since the orbitals are more than half filled, j is equal to l plus s that is equal to 1 plus 3 that is 4 let us plug in these values in the term symbol 2s plus 1 l j since s is equal to 1 2s plus 1 is equal to 3 since l is equal to 3 we write the term f and j is equal to 4 so the ground state term symbol for ni2 plus ion is 3 f4 we can say triplet f4 that is all now you can write the term symbols for the remaining atoms and ions visit adhikemistry.com for more information study material and practice questions please like subscribe and comment i am adi chavardhan from adichemistry.com